Jesus. I shall wear a I shall see God, whom I shall see for myself, and my eyes shall behold, and not another, and my heart faints within me. My brothers and sisters in Christ, we've come to celebrate the homegoing service of our dear sister Geneva Walters. We give God all praise, honor, and glory for it. it is God's divine will that such a proceeding such as this takes place. Our officiating officer which is myself and our presiding officer which is Reverend John Taylor who will be presiding over these services this day and we turn these services over into his hand Reverend John Taylor to God be the glory mm -hmm. great things he has done we stand before him today first to give him honor because he is God and besides him there is no other and the work that he does we must succumb to it what I am thankful for is that he keeps his word he will not leave us nor will he forsake us to this family we entrust you to the one who can help you sufficiently the most in hours like these. Jesus the Christ, he can help us alone. To Reverend Smalls, the efficient pastor of this church, the office of the members, and to this host that's come to celebrate the life of our dear sister, Geneva. And to you, you and you, we greet you in the joy of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. We're going to follow this program as outlined, make any necessary changes that we might have to. Our hymn, hymn 323, what a friend we have in Jesus, all our sins and grief to bear. What a privilege to carry everything to God in prayer. Oh, what peace we often forfeit. Oh, what needless pains we bear, all because we do not carry everything to God and prayer. Let us sing. What a friend we have in Jesus All our sins and griefs to bear What a privilege to carry Everything to God in prayer. Oh, what peace we often forfeit. Oh, what needless pains we bear. All because we do not care. Everything to God in are we weak and heavy laid on? Come, but with the Lord of care, precious 
Savior, still our refuge. Take it to the Lord in prayer. Do thy friend despise for sin. Take it to the Lord in prayer, and his arms you take and seal he'll be. Thou will find a solace there. Let's bow our heads. Gracious Lord, in whom we move and breathe and have our being. We come, Lord, once again to give you thanks because you are God and beside you there is none other. Lord, we want to thank you right now because of the way you have watched over us, have taken care of us from our early existence, Lord, to behold this present time. And Father, once again, in your divine wisdom, you have brought us back together. Father, we don't come today asking any questions. Because we know, Lord, that you took but your own. And Heavenly Father, we only ask today that you would keep your word. We know that you will. That you will comfort us in times like these. Help us to remember that you are a non-forgetting God. Help us to know, Lord, that you are a God of compassion. It was compassion that came yes. and touched Geneva. Mm -hmm. It was compassion that gave her a home that no one can take away from her. Father, we thank you for supplying her needs. And now, Lord, we need you. This family yet yes. needs you. Yes. This community needs you. Yes. Father God, the church and world still needs you. Mm -hmm. Heavenly Father, we don't ask you anything that's impossible because you can do all things but fail. you got all power in your hand. Yes. So, Lord, now look, if you will. Mm -hmm. Look upon this pastor today. Yes, Lord. As he stand, Lord, in John's shoe yes. to declare the wages of sin is death. Yes. But the gift of God is eternal life. He needs your guidance and your strength. Not his message, yes. but your message. Mm -hmm. Holy Spirit, mm -hmm. we feel you in the air. We yes. feel you in the wind. Mm -hmm. Come, now. Come now. Come now and comfort us. Mm -hmm. Come now and attend to us. Mm -hmm. For you are our helper, yeah. you are our keeper. Yeah. This, Lord, mm -hmm. is thy servant prayer. Yes. In the name of Jesus the Christ, amen. we call it done by faith. Yeah. Let the church say amen. 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 God bless you. And amen. amen. Following the scripture readings, we will have mm -hmm. remarks coming from Sister Patricia Washington. Acknowledgements, Natasha Weaver Smiley. And then we will be back before the solo by Brother Rufus Palmer. Our scripture reading will come today, the Old Testament will come from the book of Isaiah. Mm -hmm. And our New Testament will come from 1 Thessalonians. Mm -hmm. Isaiah 25, and beginning at verse 6. On this mountain, the Lord Almighty will prepare a feast of rich food for all people, a banquet of aged wine, the best of meats and finest of wines. On this mountain, he will destroy the shroud that enfolds all people, the sheet that covers all nations. He will swallow up death forever. The sovereign Lord will wipe away the tears from all faces. He will remove the disgrace of his people from all the earth. The Lord has spoken. And that day, they will say, surely this is our God. We trust in him, yes. and he saved us. Mm -hmm. This is the Lord. Yes. We trust in him. Mm -hmm. Let us rejoice mm -hmm. and be glad in his salvation. Yes. Yes. And the yes. reading of the Old Testament scripture. Mm -hmm. 
The New Testament will come from 1 Thessalonians chapter 4, beginning at verse number 13. Brothers, we do not want you to be ignorant about those who have fallen asleep, or to grieve like the rest of the men who have no hope. We believe that Jesus died and rose again. And so we believe that God will bring with Jesus those who have fallen asleep in him. According to the Lord's own words, we tell you that we who are still alive, we are left till the coming of the Lord. We're certainly not perceived. We're certainly not perceived those who have fallen asleep. For the Lord himself will come down from heaven with a loud command, with the voice of the archangel, and with the trumpet call of God. And the dead in Christ shall rise first. Mm -hmm. After that, we who are still alive and are left will be caught up together with them in the clouds mm -hmm. to meet the Lord in the air. Mm -hmm. And so we will be with the Lord forevermore. Amen. Here in the reading of the New Testament. Amen. The, the, the Washington Lord. will come down. every other weekend and pick me up. We would go back to New York and that's where we would spend the weekend together. If you knew my Aunt Geneva, she was a very quiet, soft-spoken mm -hmm. lady. Mm -hmm. But her heart was big. Mm -hmm. And that's what God uses to measure us by. Heart. Our heart. Mm -hmm. All of the laughs and all of the memories I will definitely keep dear to my heart. Aunt Geneva, take your rest. We love you, but God loves you best. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is nothing new. And days before that too, I think of you in silence. I often speak your name. Now all I have are memories and your pictures in a frame. Your memory is my keepsake with which I'll never part. God has you in his keeping. I have you in my heart. Giving honor and glory to God, who's the head of my life. Thank you. From the Washington family, Edward, Mardell, and Rosalind, and Emma Stevens. With sympathy, Leela, O'Neill, and William Rogers. The Weaver family would like to thank everyone who has shown us love and kindness during this very difficult time. We love you all. We appreciate you all.
It is time now that we hear yet from heaven again. These places never seem to come familiar, but they are necessary. The only way to get to God, people, is you got to go this way. Amen. I believe I'll say that again because nobody heard me. The only way to get to God, you got to go this way. Yeah. Huh? So let us make preparation to go this way. Reverend Smalls will come and tell us today a message of hope. Some you will accept, some you may not. But we ask your prayer for him because he's not standing on his own. Mm -hmm. He is in between what he wants to say and what God wants him to say and what we need. So we ask that you pray much and not sit in judgment of him today, that he will tell us what thus said the Lord. After the solo by Brother Rufus Palmer, the next voice you hear will be that of the Reverend Jerry Smalls, the pastor here of Jerusalem AME Church. Amen.
was gone to a sweet home, sweet home. That it's a beautiful home. Sweet home. Oh yeah, sweet home. Say my Lord, she's resting, y'all. Lord, I wonder. Get a home. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Glory to God. Yes, I wonder. Yes, I wonder. It's a beautiful home. We honor God this day by doing the will of God. God is always sovereign in whatever He does. We may not like what He does, but He's sovereign. He knows what's best, even when we don't. And we come to give God all praise, all honor, and glory. Because God is in control in every situation of our life. Our Father God, in the name of Jesus, we realize that hearts may be hurting. We realize, Heavenly Father, that, that, that this situation here brings out the most humblest of spirits that we have. Because we are hurting. And we need to hear from heaven. We need to know, oh God, that you are still operating in the midst of sorrow. You are God, and there is none like you. You are the creator, the ruler, the maker. And you do whatever you see fit. Help us to walk in a spirit of humility. To accept the things that we cannot change. But to acknowledge you as the Lord God Almighty. We put our hopes, oh. our trust, our fears mm. into your hands, O oh God, yes, that you will bring forth, right. Father God, the, the, the compassion that we need right and the now. healing right in our hearts this day. For we all know we must pass yeah. this way someday. Okay. Thank you in Jesus' name. Thank we pray. You. Yeah. I often say that funerals are not for the dead. Mm -hmm for the living. The living. Mm -hmm. As our presiding officer said earlier, all of us, all of us. Mm -hmm. unless Jesus comes, mm -hmm. all of us will pass this way. But in passing this way, all right. we must be very, very sure, sure. Uh -huh. that where our bags are packed, uh -huh. that every loose end is tightened up, we must make sure that there is nothing hanging on us. But every one of us must be eternally sure that on Christ, yeah. the solid rock, rock we stand. We must be sure that in our hearts, not on our lips, mm -hmm. but in our hearts, that we have gotten it right with God. Yeah. That we not know of Jesus, not know of God, mm -hmm. but we know God for ourselves. Because when this time comes, none of us will be able to say, Lord, let me go back and get it right. When this time comes, what we have done in this life and in this body, we must give an account for. The Lord just laid a scripture on my heart. Sometimes we may come prepared to do what we want to do. Mm -hmm. But you see, God knows what is necessary. necessary. Oh, yeah. In the book of St. John, All right. the 21st chapter, mm -hmm. it tells of a story at the 20th verse. Jesus is talking to Peter. It said, Then Peter, turning about, mm -hmm. seeth the disciple yeah, yeah. whom Jesus loved, oh. following which also was the one that leaned on his breath at supper right. and said, Lord, which is he that betrayed thee? Mm -hmm. Peter, seeing him, said to Jesus, Lord, mm. what shall happen or what shall this man do? Jesus said unto him, if I will that he tarry till I come. That's right. What is that to thee? follow me. 
follow me. A fitting subject follow me right. for a day like all today. Right. Right. You see, we get all mixed up, tied up, and tangled up by what everybody else does. Yeah. Right. This man, Peter, Jesus is about to leave. He's about to go away. Oh. And as they were walking, he looked back mm -hmm. and he saw this man That's following. Right. That's right. Peter was concerned about somebody right. else. He was looking back to see, why is he following? What business is it? And Jesus gave him an answer he yes, needed he to did. hear. Yes, he and did. if you will let me paraphrase it, Jesus was telling him, get your get eyes your off of others and get your eyes on me. We get mixed up, tied up, and tangled up thinking about who ain't living right, That's right. who ain't walking right, walking right, who don't come to church, who don't have this, and who don't have that. Uh -huh. And all the while we're doing that, we miss yes. out uh -huh. on our own salvation. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You see, this road of salvation, it's a rugged road. It is. Never have God promised it was going to be easy. Mm -hmm. My friends, you're going to have some ups uh -huh. and you're going to have uh -huh. some downs. Mm -hmm. You're going to have some good times uh -huh. and you're going to have some hard times. Mm -hmm. But know of an assurance that if Christ... Yeah. Is in your life. Everything gonna be all right. You see, David learned something a long time ago when he wrote what we call the 23rd Psalm. Yeah. David said, "The Lord is not was not might not maybe." He said, "The Lord is my shepherd." Everybody can't say that. No. And the Lord does not belong to everybody because everybody's not going to accept them. These are times we take an inventory of ourselves. Do you know the Lord? That's right. Jesus was trying to get Peter to understand. Make sure your heart is your right heart. before you try to clean up somebody else's heart. Make sure you're walking the straight and narrow way. Make sure that when you pray, you know you to reach in heaven. When you call upon the name of the Lord, because in times like Life this, you're going to need strength That's right. to make it through. And my brothers, my sisters, my mothers and fathers, if you don't know Christ, That's it. you're going to fail along the way. Mm -hmm. If you don't know him when trouble comes, oh. you don't have to ask what I'm going to do. Mm -hmm. You're going to fall apart. When times of sorrow like this hit, and you know Christ? David said, he leadeth me beside the still water in a time of peace. Even though all the troubles that David had, he said, God will lead me beside the still water. He'll restore my soul. He'll lead me in a path of righteousness. In other words, David was saying, God will take care. Of yeah. But in order to be taken care of, we got to know who God is. You can't know God Glory one day God. a week. No. Glory be to God. Did y'all get that? Yeah. You can't just know him coming to church, Good. sitting on a pew, not praying, not reading the scripture, not giving your testimony. You can't know him unless you have experienced the Lord God Almighty. God is making sure and he's given every one of us a chance to get our lives straight. Yeah. So that when we lie prostrate and we can't say anything else, that's right. Our life living will speak for us. Mm -hmm. Take an inventory of your lives. Make sure that you are living a life not to glorify yourself, yeah. but to glorify God. Mm -hmm. Because you see, once you transition from life to death, Paul said, and he wants us to understand, to be absent from this body, guess where you're standing? You're in the presence of Almighty, Holy God. And what will you do then when you're looking at pure love, pure peace, pure holiness, and you know for yourself whether or not you know him or not? And all he's going to have is one or two words for you.
either enter in to the master's rest. That's right. Or depart from me. I know you not. It's not important trying to please your family members to make them think you got it oh, going on. Mm -hmm. It's not important for you to try to make folks think you, and I'm going to say this, and yes, it's a funeral, you all that and a bag of chips. That's not important. What's important is whether or not your heart is clean before God. What's important is whether you know Jesus Christ for the saving grace he offers for your sins. And my sisters and brothers, if you don't know, find somebody who does. Yeah. If you don't know him, get with somebody and ask, yeah. pray with me. I got to know this man. Jesus told Peter, forget about that man back there. And you make sure, sure. because he gives every one of us a task. He told Peter, he asked him three times, do you love me? Do you love me? Do you love me? Do you love me? The first time he said, feed my sheep, uh -huh. feed my lamb, uh -huh. feed my sheep. If you love Christ, it does you no good to sit here in this service knowing that you don't love Christ. Moaning and crying and carrying on, knowing that you don't know Christ for the pardoning of your sin. Amen. Because it is damnation to your soul. Because when we stand before God, God will say to all of us here, you had a chance to get it right. Sister Geneva was an example to show all of us here today whether or not we're going to decide to serve God or serve mankind. A simple message. A simple message. But yet it's a message for somebody's heart. And it's for all of our hearts to understand that he's coming back. And when he comes, he said, my reward is with me. And I'm going to give to every man mm -hmm. as his work so is. Look at yourself and take inventory. All of us, including of us. pastors and preachers. That's right, all of us. Look at us and then make sure your work is pleasing in the sight of God. God bless you. God keep you. God will be your strength as we go through this this day, this burial experience. Right. Keep your eyes on Christ, right. and He will deliver you. In the name of Jesus, we go. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. A woman of a few days and is full of trouble, mm -hmm. come forth like a flower and withers, flee like a shadow and contendeth not. In the midst of life we are in death, of whom may we seek for secure. Mm -hmm. But of thee, O Lord, who for our sins are justly displeased. Yet, O Lord God most holy, O Lord most mighty, O holy and merciful Savior, deliver us not into the bitter pains of eternal death. Thou knowest, Lord, the secret of our hearts. Shut not thy merciful ears to our prayers, but spare us. Lord most holy, O God most mighty, O holy and merciful Savior. Thou most worthy judge eternal, suffer us not at our last hour for any pain of death to fall from thee. For as much as it pleased the Almighty God in his wise providence to take out of this world the soul of our deceased sister, we therefore commit her body to the ground, earth to earth, ashes to ashes, dust to dust. Looking for the general resurrection in the last day in the life of the world to come through our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ at whose second coming in glorious majesty to judge the world, the earth and the sea shall give up their dead and the corruptible bodies of those who sleep in him shall be changed and made like unto his own glorious body according to the mighty working whereby he is able to subdue all things unto himself. I heard a voice from heaven saying unto me, right from henceforth, blessed are the dead who die in Christ. Even so said the spirit, for they rest from their labors. Lord have mercy upon us. Christ have mercy upon us. Lord have mercy upon us. Christ have mercy upon us. We ask that you bow your heads, our Father, who art in heaven. Hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom 
the power, power and the glory forever. forever. Amen. O oh, merciful God, the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, mm. who is the resurrection and the life, mm. and whom whosoever believeth shall live though he die, mm -hmm. and whosoever liveth and believeth in him shall not die eternally. Mm. We beseech thee, O Father, to read from the death of sin unto the life of righteousness, mm -hmm. that we, when we shall depart this life, we may rest in him, and at the general resurrection at the last day, may be found acceptable in thy sight, and receive that blessing which thy well-beloved Son mm -hmm. shall then pronounce to all that love and fear thee say, mm -hmm. Come ye, blessed of my Father, receive the kingdom prepared for you from the beginning of the world. Grant this, we beseech thee, O merciful Father, mm -hmm. through Jesus Christ, our mediator and redeemer. Let the church say amen. 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 And as we close out these services with our benediction upon the family and to all those who are here, may the mm -hmm. grace of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, Christ. his grace yes. and his love, the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with you and with all of us forevermore. Let us all say amen, 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 amen. 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 Thank God for the life of Mr. Neal. Thank God for the memories of always being the hearts of his family. Thank God for our pastor, Rick Smalls, and Taylor, and the friend there has watched in the back. Thank God so much for an elder minister. Thank God for coming and showing your love to this family. To friends, whatever you've done, and so this family during this difficult time. Thank God for you. And to this family, to this family, those who don't know me, because we've worked together so many years together. And I thank God for his friendship. Thank God for love we have for each other. Always be, always be remembered of that. That's something you can't take away from me. Half of myself, my entire staff, the family, thank you so much for trusting me and our care. As we stand here and see the wind blow, yes, sir. it's a quick reminder that we are not in charge. No. Yeah. No. The power must be in us to yeah. in charge of all of this. He's working. And as we come at this moment, God, stay we come and give him thanks for what he brought us to. Mm -hmm. And if he brought us here, he will take us forward. Mm -hmm. Thank God so much for you and what you've done to come with this family. We're going to have a viewing here for anybody who has not viewed and uh, that out. We can sit ourselves dismissed. We're going to review again after it is completed. I'd like to hear some music here before I leave. And again, we need a touch. But we all need a touch. Hallelujah. We need a touch with God. Oh, no. Believe it or not. Oh. There's been a drought yeah, yeah. for way too long. We need to sing our freedom song. Oh Lord, we need a touch from you. We really need a touch.